Hey guys, Jay here, and I'm um, going to have a little RC unboxing from Dave & Buster's. Now, um, I don't know if everyone knows um, what Dave & Buster's is. Um, I don't know what states they're in or if they're in like every state. But um, Dave & Buster's is basically um, a restaurant slash video game um, slash I guess amusement or whatever um, place. Pretty Pretty big place. Um, you know, you can play video games, you can um, play games to win tickets, and that's basically what me and my wife do, is uh, we go there and we play games to win tickets. And uh, we go there on Wednesday nights, because it's uh, half-off games, so you really uh, maximize your dollar. Um, and basically, we've gotten a lot of cool stuff from there. Um, yeah, it takes some time to save. We range from... I don't know, anywhere from 6,000 to 10,000 tickets a night. Um, I've actually gotten, um, some of the bigger prizes I've actually gotten was, I guess about a year ago or better, I got an uh, Xbox 360, um, you know, Xbox 360, the Slim. Um, I've gotten um, the Kinects, um, which I still have brand new in box. I never even took it out. Um, recently... Well, before this, uh, we saved up. Um, the first one, uh, the Xbox was like 73,000 tickets. Um, we actually um, uh, got a PlayStation 4 for 105,000 tickets. So it does it does take some time to build up your tickets. Um, so you got to have patience. But got some really cool prizes from there. We've actually gotten brand new video games. Um, Usually those run around 12,000 tickets. But um, once in a great while, I get like, you know, little stuff. Um, before I got into RC um, with Traxxas and the other ones that I have, um, I was buying, I bought a couple of uh, the new Bright um, RCs that they had in there. And that's pretty much, I guess, how um, I got started on getting an actual hobby grade RC. Um, you know, the new brights were pretty cool, but I mean, you can't really do a whole lot with them. They did have good range, but I mean, you know, um, well, you know, <laughs> it's a toy grade RC, so. Um, so anyways, um, um, my wife kind of spoiled, well, she had to uh, spoil a Christmas surprise. We were actually saving for an Xbox One for me. And... Um, in the mall, there's a kiosk, a Microsoft kiosk, and she went over there and, and she was talking to the guy and she says, how much is it for an Xbox? It's got the uh, the Assassin's Creed package. And he said it's like 449 you know, with camera, with the two games, two or three games. Um, and he said if you, um, if you have an Xbox 360 or if you have a PS3, well, you can bring it in and we'll take... Um, a hundred bucks off so um, I don't use the PS3 that much anymore um, so my wife kind of spilled the beans because she wanted to save the hundred bucks she says you know excuse me would you be willing to um, you know give your PS3 up to take a hundred off um, so I can get this for you for Christmas so I said sure so Needless to say, I didn't need all the tickets that I had on the Dave and Buster's thing, so I said, um, I had seen earlier, a few weeks back, um, they had a couple of things that I thought was pretty cool in there. So, without further ado, um, let's see what I got. So this is what I picked up. Um... Again, it's, you know, not a hobby-grade RC, but um, it was very cheap on the tickets. Um, it's my first quadcopter, so, um, you know, I thought it'd be good practice um, as far as, you know, crashing and all that other stuff. Um, um, Six-axis six aircraft, four-channel. Um, what else has it got? Um... I think the other stuff is on the back. Four channel. Um, got a built in gyro. So I thought that was pretty cool for. Um, I don't know if they're all like that. But 
Um, but yeah, it got a, it's got a built-in gyro. Um, the lighting's bad. So it's got some LEDs, but I don't think anything spectacular. Um, fully charged LiPo battery will get me eight minutes of flight time. Um, what else? Um, it says that it's, you know, very stable. Um, let's see. Easy maintenance. Flight time is eight minutes. Fully charged LiPo. Um, it's got, um, It's got ascending, descending, forward, backward, left, right turn, left and right side flight, acceleration and deceleration, stall, flashing light, and controllable tumbling. And um, if I didn't mention before, it's uh, 2.4 gigahertz. Let's see. Boy, my camera's really acting up. It doesn't look like it's... Uh, really focusing here but um yeah I was kind of impressed with the gyro 360 turn indoor and outdoor I was very impressed with because um I have gotten um I think some uh, helicopters from them and they're strictly they got uh they've got built-in lipos um they're strictly indoor because of the whole infrared thing I guess um the infrared with the sun, the sun kills it somehow, I don't know, but it's only for indoor, um, LEDs, they're kind of fun, the cats like them, but, um, so I thought this was, uh, you know, I was kind of impressed with that I could use it outside, so, um, let's crack it open, my fancy my fancy camera mount here Okay, so there she is. Um, I was really, really hoping for um, um, some replacement blades. Um, oh, I didn't realize that was all plastic. I thought that was a little bit metal to it. But um, so I mean, it's one of those things that cost me 9,000 tickets to get. I don't know what that is, what that converts to in dollars, but, um, I don't know, who who knows? I mean, it could be some fun. Um, you know, it's not the greatest of construction. Um, again, I don't have any, um, replacement blades, so once these blades go, that's it. She's done. Um, I would imagine, um, I don't know, maybe you can buy replacement blade, blade, yeah. <laughs> replacement blades um, through 
um, the company. I don't know. So I'll have to look through here and see if they have like some kind of an ordering form. Um, there's the controller. It's kind of huge, but... Um, let's see. Yeah, so I mean, it's not... Not anything fancy, but... Um, looks like it could be a lot of fun. And... Um, I'll definitely put up some flight videos, and um, I think I'll start with using it in the house first. Um, but I guess that's it, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope everyone's doing fine. Um, take care, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.